Every time I come out here at low tide, I learn more about my, my tidal zone. And I'm discovering that there are really large limpets if you go into the deeper water. The ones that hang out above and are up, up on land almost sometimes are really tiny and depressing. But if you go down in deeper water, you get limpets which are really kind of large. And I have found what is quite possibly the mother of all limpets. That, my friends, is a mouthful of limpety goodness. Because he's a single shelled creature and not a bivalve, he doesn't accumulate uh, the poison, the shellfish poison. He's not filtering it out of the water, he's eating off the rock. So that's edible. That's a lot of meat right there. That's a good mouthful of protein. I'm gonna find a, see if there's any more of these guys around. These little guys are unhappy that I'm in their feeding ground, that I'm eating their stuff. I have no idea what he actually is. Weasel, mink, martin, I have no idea. They're worth their weight in gold. I'd rather watch them than eat them, to tell you the truth, because they teach me all the little things out here that I could eat. That is a pretty good haul of food. The limpets of that size make it worth a while for the hunt. They look like they'd be pretty good cooked. Anyway, I gotta go cook some limpets, and that's me for, in for the night. Alone at last. It's scary out here in these woods. My stomach is in knots.